So here's the problem. I hate the piano tiles game. It's just so fast and stressful, and I can never get past level 5. But then I had an epiphany. What if I could use AI to do the work for me? And that's exactly what I did. The first thing I did was ask ChatGPT, which is an AI language model, to write a script for me. Initially, the AI printed out a script that played Twinkle Twinkle Little Star on the piano. And let me tell you, it was a disaster. Anyways, I was able to clarify with the AI that I meant the piano tiles game, where you click on four tiles as they slide across the screen. It then gave me a script that clicks on four points on the screen, which is basically exactly what I needed. However, I couldn't stop the script from running, so I asked it to modify the script to have a way to stop it, and it added this one line, which basically stops the code when I press Q on my keyboard. Next, I wanted to improve the script so it only clicks when it notices a black tile. To do this, I needed to find the exact X and Y coordinates on my screen of where the tiles were, so I asked the AI to print the coordinates of my mouse. I then positioned my mouse where I wanted it to detect the tiles, and the code would then print my coordinates out. I also needed the RGB value of the black tile, so I could give it to the script to check if the pixel matches with the color of the black tile. RGB stands for red, green, and blue, and it is a way of representing colors on a computer screen. Essentially, every color you see on your screen is made up of a combination of these three colors. I stumbled upon the right value of the tile, which was black, and then refined the code a little bit. And it worked! The script was able to click on the black tiles as they slid across the screen. So I just realized I should probably explain the code just a little bit. So this part up here sets the coordinates of the points to check. So since there are four tiles, I want to check four different points. Next, we need the target color that we will be looking for, which is black. So that's 000. Next, we'll create a loop. So basically a loop is a part of code that will continuously run until it is stopped. So while true, it will basically get the pixel colors of the four points. So these points up here and then it will check if any of these pixels match the target color so if pixel 1 matches the target color then it will click if it matches pixel 2 then it will click as well and then I can stop the code by pressing Q on the keyboard which will break the code and stop the code and this part here basically waits for a short time before checking again and this is basically to add some delay to prevent errors from happening now back to the video However, eventually the script stopped working because it couldn't keep up with the tiles. It was like a game of cat and mouse. The tiles would slide across the screen, and the script would try to click on them, but it just couldn't keep up. To fix this, I asked ChatGPT for advice, but I kind of knew what the answer was for this, and that was to remove the time delay. And that's exactly what I did, and it worked. The script was able to keep up with the tiles, and I was able to beat the game. Now, I know what you're thinking. Wow, this guy is really smart. He must be some kind of genius to be able to be a simple game like Piano Tiles. But let me tell you, I am a genius. But it was all thanks to ChatGPT. So that's how I use AI to beat the Piano Tiles game. It was a long and difficult process. But in the end, I would rate the whole experience an 8 upon 10. The script was simple to make and effective. Although not perfect, it got the job done. Thank you so much for watching my video. and see you guys in the next one.